Hello friends, welcome back to Cuts of Life and in today's video I'm not going to show you how to cook but I'm going to show you simple steps on how to cut a whole chicken, a whole broiler that you get from a stove and uh, I'm going to show you how to cut the broiler or the chicken. So let's get started. To cut the chicken you just need a knife, a chopping board and a chicken of course. You keep two bowls. One uh, for the cut pieces and one for the skin and other winglets that you don't use in cooking. So let's get started. So first of all, you cut off the fat from the lower end of the chicken. So once this is out, you just keep it here. the winglets so once that is done you cut off the winglets from the chicken and cut from the other side too so once that is done you flip off the chicken if you can see the back side of the chicken you just give a cut so once you see it is open just put your fingers in and just tear the skin off just tear the skin off and just put your hand in and pull out the skin from the whole leg. So once the skin from one leg is out, go to the other hand and do the same. If you are doing roast chicken, if you plan to have it roasted, so there is no need to take off the skin because the skin, the fat content in the skin helps to keep the chicken moist helps to keep the whole roasted chicken moist but if you do it for any curries or any stews I do take off the skin when I cook at home and I use the skin for the stalks That's the skin that is gone off. If you can see, the chicken is all without skin. And then you can trim off any additional fat if you don't like. You can keep some as it keeps the chicken moist. So once this step is done, you cut off the wings. And go to the other end and that is done. So this, so one next step is to cut the legs. So to cut the legs, just put your hands in like this and just twist up. So if you can see the bone that has come out, that means it is already dislocated. So if you can see the leg and the thigh that has come out, you can do it on the other side too. You can cut this off, you can keep this aside. Now to cut the breast off, what you do is, you can see two small bones over here, one on this side and one on the other side. So you just give a small cut by the bone, the bone should come out of the rib cage and from the neck. So you put your finger over here under the neck and you just pull this off and this carcass some of them use for stocks, some of them consume it and uh, we'll just keep it up on the side for now and you can see the fat from here, just keep up over here. So you can see the whole breast, the chicken breast, you can just cut it off from the cartilage. And this is two bony breast along with the supreme all right so when you serve a portion in a restaurant you get a leg and a thigh like for fried chicken you get a leg and a thigh and you get the breast but for now we'll do curry cut pieces so curry cut pieces or stew cut pieces 
are small pieces so the press will go into three one two and three so we'll keep the press over here one two and three the next one here and let's move on to the leg and the thigh so this is the thigh and this is the leg or this is the drumstick if you cut on the cartilage that's over here you won't see any blood stains coming up from the leg so that's the leg and the thigh and we'll do same for the next one too so this is the leg and the thigh and then the two wings so that's the simple steps of cutting a chicken and uh, it's a curry cut if you do uh, roast if you plan to roast the chicken as i said earlier there is no need to remove the skin of the chicken and uh, you can mar just marinate stuff in your requirements and just roast it in a preheated oven so that's your curry cut chicken and most of them use the skin they cut along with the skin I prefer not to use the skin because uh, the skin contain, contains a lot of fat. So once uh, you have that skin, you can use it for your stock. You, you can make a soup out of it and you can use for different dishes. So if you would like to have small pieces, cut it, the chicken cut into small pieces, you can do so. You can uh, leave the whole breast and a leg and a thigh to get a big portion, a restaurant style, you can do so. You can leave the skin on top of the chicken like the skin of the chicken I prefer not to use the chicken skin as it contains a lot of fat as I said earlier and uh, you can use the three, three by three pieces so like three from the breast three from the other breast and two and two from the leg and the thigh and the small wings if you would like to use the carcass the neck you can use it too so that was the simple steps on cutting the chicken and uh, that's about it so thank you once again for watching video so you have reached the end of the video please don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated with cuts of life and thank you for watching